now to Chart Talk. Matt Cavanaugh, CMZ Trading, joined us now, and he's taking a look at a couple of high-flying stocks. Hi, Matt. Hi. Let's start with Netflix. This was not a stock that you have been a fan of. However, it has performed quite well over the past year, you have to admit. Yeah, absolutely. You know, I, I haven't really loved it because it's been so tough to trade. You know, this stock was close to $300 before, sold all the way off to the 50s, and here we are back at the $300 range. So definitely a stock that's tradable. Uh, me from the trader side, I think there are good things happening from this company, but man, is it expensive, and uh, I would fade the rally. I really would. 250% in nine months is a lot. Well, traders have been trying to push this stock higher. It finally got over the $300 mark. Will that mean anything in trading today for the stock? You know, it's tough to say. I think there was some good news that helped propel it there, maybe squeeze some of the short sellers out. But, you know, it's really an expensive stock, and they've really got to deliver to make this thing push, push forward. So maybe there's a little bit of upside, but I really think that you've got more on the downside. Facebook is another big mover. Facebook shares hit an all-time high yesterday of $45 and then some, and it even traded higher in the after-hour session last night. What does that tell you about this stock? Well, how has sentiment changed? I mean, we were about a month and a half ago, people were worried that Facebook wouldn't be able to make money on their mobile. And, and here we are, they beat on their mobile, stocks up almost 70%. So this is another one, probably not quite as expensive, but you know, the trader in me really would love to fade this rally, if you will. Matt, thank you for your tips today. Thank you.